A 12-year-old boy won't be remembered for the crash that took his life. Now, instead, he's being remembered tonight as a middle schooler who danced through life. Beth Vaughn is live in Lee's Summit, where a candlelight vigil just ended. Beth? Yeah, Mark, the children who once shared a stage with Waylon Green honored the 12-year-old tonight and comforted his three older brothers, all at a place that Green loved to be, stepping out studio. It was fitting that these flames danced in the wind tonight because the candles were lit for a dancer, a young man no one was ready to let go. Certainly he didn't live as long as we would have hoped that he would live, but he didn't waste a minute. Waylon Green died this morning in a car crash when his mother swerved and then the vehicle rolled on Interstate 470. His mother and older brother both survived. God be with he and his family. Phyllis Bologna's studios were empty tonight. Her dancers given the evening to mourn one of their own. We don't realize the impact sometimes we make on people's lives. This little boy at 12 made a profound impact on our lives. The DVD of Green's final recital with Steppin' Out Studio now holds a special spot in her heart. In this number, Green and his older brothers dance together, front and center. We all embrace these kids. Um, we put our arms around them, and this is one that we particularly embraced with lots of love and care. His family, too emotional to speak on camera tonight, told me the Bernard Campbell middle schooler was trying his hand at wrestling and football, though according to his brother, Green's true talent was fixing cars. Brought all kinds of joy and energy to people. A handful of gifts given to a young man whose life was cut short. A 12-year-old son, brother, and friend remembered tonight by this crowd and many more. Mark and Krista, there were just so many tears tonight outside this dance studio, and we're told that the students at Lee Summit School District were also notified today, their parents as well. We can assume that tomorrow will be another tearful day at school. We're live tonight. Beth Vaughn, NBC Action News. Oh, that is a big loss. All right, Beth, thanks.